Killing Floor 2 is currently free to download over on Epic Games. So I thought for a change I'm going to put my Epic Games account to use and actually download one of these free titles. Of course, as I expected before I started playing, it's heavily inspired by the likes of Call of Duty Zombies and Left 4 Dead. Upon booting up this game, I was immediately greeted with a cash shop and as always, you know how I feel about all that crap. But that being said, I'm currently not reviewing this game based on whether you should buy it, but whether you should bother to get it for free and install it. Setting up a game for you and your mates couldn't be easier, but primarily this is a wave based shooter. You can pick the amount of waves or even go on infinitely. You're never quite safe from an enemy when you get backed into a corner. They come from everywhere, bursting out of walls, coming through windows. It's got a good difficulty threshold. You've definitely got to get them headshots in to stop these waves from coming. There's all sorts of creatures and classes to deal with, from spider zombies and clown zombies. You've got your classic boomer zombie that pukes over you, pretty much taken from Left 4 Dead 2. One of the unique aspects of this game was the bullet time effect, and I say unique because it's nothing new. But what is unique is that it affects all players at the same time. It just helps break up the action and uh, uh, who, I mean, who doesn't like bullet time? I would say that if you're into games like Left 4 Dead 2 and you've got a group of mates, preferably I would say four or more, then this is definitely worth a try. It's a good laugh. I myself am not likely to jump into a random group. I always prefer to play these games with my friends. And between me and a group of friends, all we've got to do is take out these waves of zombies. The sandbox that we all set up was a map that was broken into waves of four. Between rounds, you can actually go and buy some new weapons, get some upgrades and refill your ammo. And as the time goes on, the waves get harder and harder. I felt with the amount of choice in classes and perks, systems and guns that you can actually get, combined with the amount of maps that you've got, there's a wealth of content here to explore and not get bored of. But, like I say, it's free on Epic Games, so go and grab yourself a copy and tell a few of your friends. I'm personally enjoying it. I'm not likely to jump in and do daily quests or really get into this game hardcore, but it's definitely something that I've got sat to one side that I can put on and have a laugh with, and I'm definitely going to jump into it again. So it's just a quick heads up from me. Have a good weekend, everybody, and I'll be returning with some ARK very soon. Until next time, I'm James from Complete Games. And I'll see ya.